Morning, pot pickers. What's in the news today then, Chucky? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That first story is a bit interesting, though. Being reported, says here the Tory party is going to stand down at the next general election. Says, having considered its position and after a period of much reflection, the entire Conservative Party has decided not to seek re-election in 2024. The party issued a statement thinking, thanking the voters sorry, for supporting it over the previous years, but now it's no longer wished to be considered as a candidate for government, having spoken to wives, husbands, families, other people's wives, other people's husbands, other people's families, and to mention reality TV producers, publishers, accountants, speaking agencies and headhunters, the party has concluded that now is a good moment to move on. Said the party, I intend to explore other career opportunities outside of politics if there are any left after 12 years in government. He added, it doesn't work out. I may consider entering the charity sector, in which case I'll be sitting with an empty hat on your street with a sign saying, I'm hungry, homeless and very right wing. Please help. <laughs> what newspaper was that in? That was in the private eye. Look at that there. Oz, Oz Memmi Pink. Slash his heart attack and stroke risk. Game changing new statins. Are they just like pharmaceutical companies? What are they, what is that all about? Oz, Oz M Pink. It's just public. What's going on? The late great Hannibal Lecter, he's a, fun, he's a nice man, says Keir Starmer in his trial in New York. China has an arrest, the UK, everyone's... Weight loss, jab, that helps you too. Heart deaths by a fifth. Labour recalls calls rent caps to tackle growing housing crisis. Front page of the... Guardian, British nature in crisis and every political party, no one gives a fuck about the wildlife. Um, Daily Mirror, they're going with, what do you think they're going with? What do you think they're going with? The, the smash to pieces, all the, the aid going into Gaza. Um, the war in Gaza, child poverty, homelessness. No, they're going with Man United to tell their wags, find your own in way to Wembley. <laughs> Does that even mean? It's going a deep, 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 dark deal. Man United wags face paying for their own trips as the club acts as perks to cut costs. Means the likes of Harry Maguire's wife, Fern, may be denied their usual lavish freebies at plush hotels for the Wembley clubs. I woke up this morning and it's fucking raining again. <laughs>